not to be sharp here. folks how y'all doing how are y'all doing good to have you here good evening hello 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 welcome in go ahead and do your shares early we can get our shares going thank you guys so much for being here real simple one for us tonight i always say it's real simple right we got some lobster tails we're just going to not get crazy with them we're just going to let the lobster meat uh, shine through. We're going to get a nice little butter, melted butter and garlic and some of our Creole blend and some parsley. And I just put a little more um, smoked paprika for color and a little taste in there. We're going to do our chowder. Should be pretty simple. Um, we're going to get some bacon rendered down. Um, we got a lot of vegetables as we always do. We have celery in here, some carrots, some sweet pepper. Um, we got a little bit of garlic in here. We got some taters and some sweet onion. We got some uh, paste, some tomato paste, a little flour, a little sweet cream. Um, couldn't find any of my cream of, sh of shrimp soup that I get from Campbell's a lot of time to do my shortcuts. So I'm going to use cream of celery today. Got some white wine here. We got some cornstarch. We're going to be using our spicy seafood and our go-to. And we got shrimp. And corn. I'm gonna have to pull the corn out of the freezer. All right, so we're gonna get ready to get started, and let's start this music here. And welcome, y'all. Uh -huh. Thank you guys, thank you guys. Carla, thank you for the 100 stars. Appreciate you, appreciate you. Yes, yesterday was my birthday. Um, am I still celebrating? Uh, I didn't do too much celebrating today. We actually have, um, we got a lot of work done. We got some, uh, I don't wanna show anybody's uh, address, but we got two really nice cards from John um, and Pache Douglas. One for my birthday, so I'm just gonna read this real quick. Just to uh, um, thank these guys. I'll read the birthday one. They also sent a sentiment one for um, for our, our passing of our grandson. And they wrote, birthday wishes from both of us. May the joy of, of favorite memories wrap around you. The light of your dreams shine with you, within you. Um, and the happy wishes we're both sending you come true in countless special ways. And they put a nice little, little personal note in there. So we love you to the moon and back back. Um, and they also put a little bit of money order in there. So ain't none of your business how much the money order was. I know y'all like, how much was the money? Or oh, ain't none of your business, okay? Okay, Tasha, what's going on? Um, we're going to get, hopefully my cameraman is ready right now because I'm ready to start getting getting going in here. My cameraman, he just, he'd be like, he'd be like, just got off work, so he had a full day, so. He, he like, oh, do I got it? Yeah. What's up, Larry? Rebecca, Amanda, Barbara, and Patricia Bostic, thank you also for your 100 stars. Um, Y'all are the best. Good to have you guys, man. So real simple. It's good to have you all. Thank you all for sharing. And uh, we're going to turn the camera over to uh, cameraman Daryl so he can awesome. greet and we can start getting this darn thing going. What y'all think about that? We're going to start with Carol. Look, the McCoys is in the house. What's up? Here you go, sir. Go ahead and take over. In your, in your, your capable hands. We're going to 
Sure, appreciate you. Certainly will. Boom. A lot of people are saying happy birthday. Also, also, birthday. real quick before we start, um, we are having, we're doing a pop up in Virginia Beach in the Vibe District, which is right on the, babe, what is that? Thirty Fourth Street. I'm not sure. Virginia Beach Sunday. Know. We're gonna be there Sunday. Oh my God! Why do I can't remember the times either? I'll try to put it on on, the, on our, our page. I mean, you this. did get older, so. Yeah, I did get older. One year older. So we're going to be in the Vibe District. We're going to be doing a pop-up real quick. Um, so if you need the spice blends, you want to come out and meet us. It's a good time to do wear your mask, please. Um, we also, I'm also going to have my art there because it's an art crawl. And if you wanted to purchase one of my pieces of art, it's the time. I'm just taking the offers. I'm not, I don't have them set for prices. You know, um, so we're gonna see what happens. So that's only this Sunday. I put the information on there. So let's start getting this render down. Let's get this render down. All right. Let me see what's going on in down. here. And Charvel Harrison, thank you for the 50 stars. Oh, I thought you said she said that. No, no, no. How you doing, Carolyn Marshall and Iris Stone? I got a John Lee. So uh, she haven't had lobsters in a while, okay. How you doing, Leonard Williams? Who is this, Twilight Applegate? Okay, so she loves our shows, okay. Oh, thank you so much. And I got a a Ida Jean Hyman. Ida Jean, you give stars. If you look at your comments, I would actually type your comments, scroll to the right, I believe. And you should see the actual yellow star there. And then just follow the directions from there and you should be good. Somebody said on iPhones the other day when you were here, they said Different. there's three dots. Mm. If you get the three dots, then you'll see. Oh, yeah. Gotcha. I might be, I might not know what I'm talking about. I don't know. Uh, somebody, one of our grateful fans would definitely help her out. Wow. <laughs> I got a whole lot of happy birthdays. Happy birthdays, okay. Thank you, guys. And thank you, you for all your birthday wishes, too. I've read them all, but I couldn't respond to everybody, of course. So thank you so much. I'm old, y'all. Mm -hmm. I'm old now. <laughs> Barbara answered that Moscato looks good. <laughs> yeah, I just got that because I know normally when I do this, I put a little white wine and we don't have anything but reds in here. So I just grabbed that and I knew it was a sweet. Um, it's called Roscato. I'm not trying to give any endorsement to anything, but I know it was a white, but I know that we also like sweets here. It's more likely to get drunk. Drunken, is that the, no, not drunken, drank, drank. Yeah. Yeah. If, if it's a more of a sweet wine. How you doing, Gertrude Green? G-Mono. Hey, mama. mama Tony Parent says, we appreciate you sharing the video, we really do. Mama's not going to eat any of this, I guarantee you that much. Yvette Miner, thank you for the 50 stars. Erica Walton, how you doing? How you doing, Mika Jones? Got a Anna Justin. Wait, hold on. Justin Anna? Justin Anna? I hope I said that last name right. Justin Iano. Justiniano, maybe? That's probably Justiniano? what it is. Yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> Justiniano, okay. Like what you, Definitely what you sounds Italian. Like sounds yeah, it sounds really Italian. Justiniano. Got a Tammy Torres. Aries Taylor. Dorothy Johnson, Janine Lee, okay. Guys, this web this um recipe is also on our website already, so it's another easy one for me. And Deborah Levis said 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Thank you, Deb. So it's 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. in the Vibes District, of Virginia Beach, which is right on the beachfront. Um, it's the Art District of Virginia Beach. So if you're in the Virginia Beach, in the Tidewater area, you might want to come out and meet us. Um, they're doing, there's an art crawl going on, so they're going to all the art galleries, and we're popping up at one of the galleries. Um, I, I, want, I keep wanting to say it's 34th Street, but it's probably absolutely wrong when I'm saying the address. Um, the place is called Vertical Vibe Space. Vertical Vibe Space. You can look that up, Google it, and that's where Anita and I will be, but we'll have our spice blends, we'll try to bring a couple of um, sets of knives if you're looking to buy some knives and some of the shirts, aprons, and I'll try to have some of my art there too, okay? And then we'll see you guys there. 
And Deidre Marshall, thank you for the share. Shirley, glad you got your season in. Suzette Laws, thank you for the 50 stars. Renee Wagner, thank you for the 200 stars. Yeah, I'm trying to catch up and deleting y'all stuff pretty fast. And Tammy Sweet Smith, thank you for the 50 stars. Okay, I had to skip a couple of y'all. Oh, Nandine Davy from Trinidad, I see you. And Iris Stone, gotta place another order, Iris. We're not gonna stop you. <laughs> But definitely not. <laughs> Suzette Laws, really? <laughs> not a DJ, not at all. Got a Patricia McBride from Mixport, Pennsylvania. Okay. Mixborough? Nah, Mixport. Mixport. Mickeysport, I guess. Uh, Mickeysport. Mickey yeah. Oh Nicole Lee Lobster is my favorite. Okay. I'm getting uh, some of this. Uh, this, this uh, I was going to say gravy, mm -hmm. this bacon grease, I'm reserving some of that because I want to cook the vegetables also in there. I'm going to reserve the other half of it for um, the um, other stuff that I'm cooking in this pan. Okay. And Rosie Lavardi, happy early birthday. For the shrimp. Alright. And I got a question from Patricia, Mc Patricia McBride asked, what did they get you for your birthday? Um, I got a uh, art set from my great kids. Um, I got a bunch of money. I got a free dinner that I didn't have to cook. Uh, I got a bunch of cards. I got a bunch of well wishes from you guys. Um, that was it. You know, when you're old, you just kind of like the big part of you, you know, like remember when you were young and it would be like, listen, we're going out, we're going to do this, we're going here. Like when you're old, it's just like, let's go eat food. Mm -hmm. That's like, that's like every, every celebratory, every celebratory uh, um, choice. So that's what we did. We went and ate good food, you know, good food is life. So shared it with people I love. So boom, boom, boom. boom. Shirley Turner, happy birthday. So we got the bacon, nice crispy bacon we're going to add there in the end. And we Casey get... Kendall said her son, Daryl Bonet, made your, your chicken marsala recipe. Okay. I mean, that was good. So we got some nice little jumbo shrimp here. We're going to add our cooking with grains, uh, spicy seafood blend. Why? Because we like it. M-O-U-S-C. We're going to put a lot of it in there. Sandy Curtis, thank you for the 50 stars. And, and Carlo Hamilton, thank you for your 50 stars. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook these. I usually don't do this, um, but I'm going to cook these ahead of time. Um, I usually let them cook in the broth, but we're doing this a little different today, okay? So we got that spicy seafood on there, seasoned in there. And what are we going to do with it there? I'm going to show you right and now. Vicky Ingram, thank you for the 150 stars. I'll get these bad boys in here. Omar Woods, how you doing? I'm going to get a little toasting, we're going to get a little blackening, and we're going to get some nice, plump, delicious shrimp. I cooked up and ready to go. Abbas King, how you doing? Gotti Ramsey, I see you. Gotti is doing nose. great things, y'all. Y'all better get some of his uh, therapy sauce. He got some really, really good uh, all-purpose sauce that he sells. So if you don't follow him, I think he's got a web. I think he's got a website, but I don't know what it is. But I can get it for you if you want. And how Probably are you TherapySauce.com. I think yeah. that's what it is. And if I'm wrong, then I'm sorry, God. You'll, you'll get it right. Andrea and PV, how are you doing? Since you wanted a special shout out. And Pamela Colbert asked, "Can you bake lobster tails?" Yes, you can. I'm going to broil these ones. Or well, you can bake them. Um, it doesn't, well, what they, they're they better because you don't want them to dry out. I would suggest cooking them at a super high temperature like a broil. Um, I mean, but you can boil them. I don't know why you would do that anyhow, but you can. You can steam them. Um, you can saute them in butter. Um, there's a lot of ways to cook them. Um, but broil is going to be easier, fastest, to retain a lot of the, uh, the flavor. So. I probably wouldn't bake them. So, so I guess to answer your question, I probably wouldn't do that. That was a long-winded no. Yeah. <laughs> Denise Bradley, thank you for the 50 stars. And Joe Name McHenry Kane, thank you for your 50 stars as well. 
Judy Richardson. Thank you for your 50 stars. And I know I missed a couple of y'all. I do apologize, but I got to get where I can fit in. Get in while you fit in. Uh, 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 uh. What's that? <laughs> and then Shirley Miller said, the lobster tongues are huge. Did they come from the land of the giant? <laughs> what was giant? Why? They said they're huge? Yeah, they said they're huge. Yeah, they were $9.99 a pound, which is really good price for lobster tail. So, um, I think two, like two were about $19. So they were a little more expensive, but we don't have lobster all the time, you know? We don't have it every day, so. Angie Ratliff, that is too funny. I'm not even going to repeat that out loud, but that's funny. <laughs> I believe that's my, one of my favorite movies, too. Evelyn Warner got her seasonings on Thursday. Happy uh, for you. But was you going to cook with them, though, Evelyn? You want to see that picture? You got to see it. She going to cook everything with you know. You better ask somebody, Daryl. I'm trying to find out. She's going to tell me. She's fixing to cook everything with us. And Tasha Matthews from New Orleans. Got nothing but love for the N.O. And Barbara Rivers. Good evening, Greens family from Charlotte, North Carolina. What up, Charlotte? I'm praying for you and your family. Amen and happy birthday. Thank y'all. I appreciate you guys so much. Y'all actually helped us get through a hard time. You know, and that's what family's for. So we really, 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 really appreciate you for that. Alright, so I like what he I like what he's bad and for though. Anthony Kirby is asking, uh -huh. are lobsters cooked the same way as crab legs? Can be. Um, but I'll I'm gonna show you. How's about that, uh Anthony? What's your name? <laughs> Whatever your name was, Anthony. Mm. We go uh, I had a herpes scroll. Anthony uh, Kirby. Yeah. Anthony Kirby. I'm gonna I'm gonna let you know in a second, boo boy home slice. I would suggest again like I had someone else who asked earlier just to cook it at a high temperature um, but I'm going to show you how to do it real simple. You can fry these things you can deep fry them, you can do whatever And Gotti Ramsey said hit him up for some products sir he needs some <laughs> Most definitely so hit him up. Most definitely. And Queenie Best, thank you for the 200 stars Gloria P. Carter, watching cooking with the greens. Weather here in Mississippi from Hurricane Delta is getting a lot of rain. Y'all better be safe out there. I just remember that story where it was like I think a couple years ago when that dude like barricaded his whole house with the um with the sandbags and all that stuff. He his his land was the only land that was still green with no water. Why right? everybody else around him was probably flooded out. Was green with no water. Oh, yeah, green, yeah. Like it. it was just like regular. Okay. But he put so many sandbags and everything around his house uh -huh. that he literally kept almost all the water off his property. It was crazy. Okay, guys. So, Darius can show what we have right here if you like. Call the right our Campbell. Thank you for the 200 stars. Okay. If you don't know what this is, people, you're not living right. Because this is life. Back on. That what it is was. Back on. Andrea and PV, Mom Deuce is relaxing right now. She had a long and busy day. So, we already had a little of that bacon grease. We're going to add a little olive oil and sweet cream butter, unsalted. Why? Because we like to control our salt. So we're not going to add salt to things. We're not going to buy things that are already salted, if at all possible. And Joanne Porter said you had a great birthday dance. I did. Y'all like birthday dance? <laughs> I'll be getting down, y'all. So we're going to add um, some sweet peppers, and a little carrots that are cut small, and one whole celery stalk. Again, the recipe, she is on the website. We're going to get that in there. We're going to start cooking that down, and then we're going to add the taters, and the onion, and a little bit of garlic there. Well, you know what? So we like to add color and veggie mate blaze in our pan. And Dominic Stringfellow, if we throw you this shrimp, you better catch it. <laughs> Throwing shrimp. Mm -hmm. Throw shrimp. Ooh, Regina Purcell having turmeric and curry chicken with cream of chicken, collard greens, Wait and kale for dinner. Turnip and curry. Turmeric and curry chicken. Oh, turmeric and curry. With cream of chicken, collard like greens, that. and like kale that. for dinner. Right. I mean, she didn't use any commas. I like her comment, but she didn't use no commas. That's all. It's okay. It's yeah. okay. It's all right. And Iris Stone, her birthday is on the 28th of this month. Okay, happy oh, okay. early birthday, happy Iris. Birthday. Happy birthday. I know somebody hit, up, hit me up today and said that her birthday was today. So happy birthday to them, definitely. 
you know, it's it's Libra season, y'all. It might be my birthday all month. I got. I'm thinking. I might just go ahead. Oh yeah, I forgot to say I got a hat. I got a dress hat too. It's on the way. Mm -hmm. It's on the way here. I forgot. And Tammy Rush said broiled is the best. There you go. But I don't, it's just talk about a after you butterfly them. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that real quick. We're gonna do that. Real quick. We're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and give it a little slip, slip, slip. Actually, done. Let's, let's. While we're sitting here looking at that. Trinice Webner, New Orleans. I see you. We're gonna take these these tails. We're gonna take some nice good kitchen shears, hopefully sharp, and we're gonna cut it right down the middle to the end of the tail, like so. Boom. Once we got that done, we're gonna take this bad boy and lift up the meat. That's the fun part here. We're gonna crack it a little bit. Joy is saying good no. Who don't like a big tail though? We're gonna lift up the meat with a hand there. We're gonna lift it out of the shell. We're gonna close the shell in and lay it over like this. That's how they do it in the in the restaurant. Simple butterfly. Alisa Watkins, thank you for the 50 stars. Crush stations, man. Huh. And <laughs> took took said look like you was frying ch frying chicken livers, but I know you wasn't. <laughs> took took. <laughs> What today? <laughs> That's what it looked like he said. Oh, when I was doing the bacon, mm -hmm. man. Yeah, right. Wow, Joshua Genzel. Now your dad got to the store. Does he get a, a senior citizen discount now? Why? Yeah, you know what? I should start <laughs> looking into that. Look, I ain't, mm -hmm. like, ain't shame. That sounds like a deal right there. Now we got. We got like it looks like we got two females. You can tell by the flesh is a little more pink. Well, this one actually might be just a female. The flesh is usually a little more pink than um. So it looks like we might got we might have all females, babe. We'll I'll find out in a second. We'll get into this third one. And Sheila Holmes, thank you for the two hundred stars. The female meat's supposed to be a little sweeter. It's okay if you cut into the meat a little bit. That's fine. Yep, all females. All female. And Carla Hamilton, waiting for my spices. I'm excited to use them to make clam fritters. Ooh. We'll post a pic when I do so. Yummy and your spice mix will make them even better. See, Carla, I like you already. You pay attention. See, that's <laughs> what I'm talking about. She already know what she's supposed to do after she create that magic. That's what I'm talking about. Boom, boom, boom. How about, okay, just oh, and Evelyn Warren, chicken wings and fries. My oh, grandson loved the maple bacon on his fries. I like that one. Boom, we're going to add the onion and the taters and a little bit of garlic. Huh? Oh, thank you, babe. I'm gonna go ahead and let that cook a little bit. And, and, Jean, oil. and Jean Lee said, please tell the news that the cash app is for the birthday young man yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So she got it, Jean. Miss that? She ain't hold my money, did she, John? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna add our Creole blend, a little bit of smoked paprika, a little a lot, a lot of bit of garlic, and a little bit of chopped dry parsley. Probably need to put this in the mic a little more longer. Eh, maybe not. And this, guys, we're gonna brush over the lobster tail. And I don't want to put it in yet because it's gonna take about seven minutes or so. You want to get the lobster tail about 145 degrees. Um, so I'll probably use my thermometer to make sure I do this right. So I'm not gonna put those in until I'm ready to, ready to, you know, to eat. So those are going on last. So that's as simple as butterfly. And Pamela Coburg says she's having shrimp on her menu for Thanksgiving. Okay, really? that's what I'm talking we about. Shrimp as Forget as tradition, as just enjoy it. As much as possible, we have shrimp. So we have shrimp as much as possible. But I understand. No. And Mika Hill, I love lobster tails, and I love to make minced lobster too. Minced. 
lobster. Yes, lobster. 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 Yep. The last time we made lobster, I think we made lobster po' boys. Mm -hmm. Lobster and shrimp po' boys, I think yeah. it was. <laughs> Stella Jack said Mr. King was trying to twerk for his birthday. <laughs> I was getting down on my birthday, y'all. Everybody who watched it. Yesterday we gave a little sneak peek of us at the restaurant mm -hmm. and they had me dancing for dollars, so y'all missed the move. Y'all missed the moves. Thank uh, everyone actually that's been donating. Uh, we appreciate you guys. Um I don't know what number that I think is. I think it's three fifty nine or is it three fifty four? Somebody know, done scratched it. I don't know who did that. It wasn't me though. Jesus. How you doing, Carol Sanders and Crystal L. Green? Everybody saying, hey, ma. But she done walked off people, my bad. Yeah. He is working hard. We, cause we, anytime we have a pop-up, we, we you guys know to order our, our spice blends. We do our, our spice blends. Um, small batches usually by order. So if we know, like, okay, we got a bunch of orders, we'll make a, a, a small batch. So everything's fresh all the time. That's a lot of reason why when you get them, people are like, man, I had this and it started clumping up because it's literally fresh, round, um, still has a lot of moisture in it, um, but it's still fresh. So don't worry about it. You might have to shake them up every once in a while again. They don't have any caking agents in it. So that's the reason why. So when we have pop-ups, that means we have to go ahead and get a lot of other stuff ready. So we've been working hard today. Let's just say that. And Barbara Ann said you should celebrate your birthday all month because it's your business. I like how you think, girl. How you doing, Tyrone like Samuels? All right, so we're going to add a little bit. And Jacqueline Houston, her birthday is October 18th, two days after my daughter's. How about that? Oh, okay. Yeah, we're gonna add on a little bit. Let's, let's, let's deal this with you. And Tammy Rush said, get the vein out, Derek. I guess she's a What a vein that Tammy Rush? What I don't know. Let us know, Tammy. Let us know. What about what about that boo boo? So we're gonna add a little bit of tomato paste here. An aqua the bullock stock. Happy birthday. This is all the eighth, but happy birthday anyway. Her birthday is on the eighth. Mm -hmm. That my twin right there. And up, Erica Wilson asked, "Do you devein your lobster?" I usually don't. I usually don't. Um, usually when I cut down here, if you look at the meat. It's pretty clean. You see? Mm -hmm. And you can tell that these were starved because that's what, pretty much what they do before they harvest them. They starve them so nothing's in them. All right, so boom. And Shirley Turner, enjoy tomato. your birthday dinner. Again, happy birthday. Tomato paste, we're gonna add a little bit of, just a little bit of flour. And Vanjie was, oh, I messed her name up. Was it, what was it, I forgot. The sale? I forgot now. Vanjie Boiseau. I'll tell her, Vanjie, I'll tell her. All right, there we go. So look at it, look what we got in there. Get on in there mm -hmm. so they can see what they talking about over there. They see what we talking about. What we is talking about. Okay. How you doing, Ian Ward? So we want to get that Velvia like that. And Robinson. And then the next thing we want to add here is... Life. She rough. Life. <clears throat> and I'm gonna. Go and ahead. Charlene Tyson her season is today. That's what I'm talking about, Charlene. So we're gonna add a whole box to this amount. This is low sodium again. Try to get as little as little salt as you can. How are you doing, like Gail Williams? But you want to protect yourself from too much sodium. Or you want to control it if you're gonna have it, you know. And Sarita Herrera said, "I'm cooking conch fritters with all my Ooh, seasoning with the green seasoning." You know seasoning. I never tried. I never made conch. I'm gonna have to do that. I'm gonna have to do that. That's on. That's on my list now. I think I've I've had conch before. I've had I had it before conch. I've I never it made it. I never made it. Um, but you know. But Sarita, make sure you post that picture so we can see the magic. Let us see it. And D Stafford, thank you for the 200 stars. And she says, hello, Greens family. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thank you all. I'm a Connecticut fan. Okay. We love all our fans, man. We love them all. Let me go ahead and let this get a little marinated butter and garlic and spices on top of here. 
even though we have plenty. And somebody said you look pretty today, Dad. <laughs> Carla Hamilton gave you and mommy a compliment, but made sure to say she was pretty. Yeah. They're going to tell me I'm pretty today, too. Oh, well, that's nice. <laughs> and Barbara Lloyd, welcome to the channel. First time viewer. Don't be a stranger, though. Definitely don't be a stranger. What's wrong with that? How you doing, Susan Linton? Got Reese the Leo Moore. Okay. Reese the Leo. Yo, oh, he's he out of asked, season. "What's the mixture that you use brushing on the lobster tongue?" Because he missed it. Ah, that was um about about a stick of uh, um unsalted sweet cream butter. Um, I added our cooking and greens Creole blend. Um, in, in there, pink Himalayan Creole blend. We added a little bit of uh of smoked paprika for a little more color, and about two large cloves of garlic. Um, mint's really good and a little bit of dry parsley. So mm -hmm. that's all that's in there. So that we don't just let the we want that flavor to, to, to come through, but we also want to have some of that some of that garlicky, buttery, sweet butter flavor on that, that meat. And then we're gonna use that as a different sauce afterwards. We're gonna just melt that down a bit. Come on, come on. They tell me if you watch a pot, it boils. And Anna Justin, I don't, I don't know mess her name up again. Say so she's making using our seasonings to make Creole to make the Creole season to make Spanish rice with pigeon peas. Okay, mm, that's gonna be good. That's gonna be good. Creole is like one of our popular, popular, popular blends. Creole, um, when we first started, the barbecue was really hot. Um, herb, onion, black pepper, the maple bacon, of course. Mm, all of them, all of them, all of them. All of them. I'm gonna start naming them all if I keep. And Charvella Harrington. My mom's 70th birthday is October 19th. Okay. And two of the things I'm making is lobster mac and cheese and bacon wrapped shrimp with the balsamic fig drizzle. That's what I'm talking That's about. Talk. That sounds for real. You got to put some pictures up in the group. Right? When you do that. that sounds cereal. So I like that already. That already sounds good. It do sound really good. Now I'm, now I'm going to cheat, guys. And add some cream and celery soup in here. And Michelle, um, right, my mother's birthday is October 18th, and I miss you, miss my mom, rest in peace. Oh, We usually add um, cream of shrimp when I do this easy, quick uh, chowder. But nobody had I went to three stores. I'm like, man, when I see this in the store, I need to just buy it. But I think that's what everyone else is doing anyhow, so that's why I can never get it. Either that or, or order via Amazon and just have it at home all the time. And Joyce saying good note, her youngest son's birthday was October 2nd. Okay, I have to belate it. And Anita Peters, her son's birthday is October 18th. Okay. Got a lot of Octobers in right. here. Okay, so we're just going to let that do its, its darn thing. I'm gonna pass it. And Sandra Weaver, her birthday is October Covered 20th. So okay, happy early birthday. We get, we like three quarters of the way there, y'all. We so much far there, I think I'm going to... Pour me a little less Roscado. And Latasha Dimon like. said lobster is usually de veined before selling. Then the only ones with veins are live. Oh, hmm, see okay. That? You done taught me something. Because every time I look at tails, they always are clean. That's why I didn't even look at it. But I know somebody, I should have known somebody was going to say, hey, did you de vein that? Look, I'm learning. <laughs> I didn't know that myself. And Lisa Menenda, happy birthday. Derek, Anita got the best gift of all time as a man that knows his way around the kitchen. <laughs> that's good. That's like a Moscato almost. I'll take your word for it. Sweet white. That's, that's almost like a Moscato. So we're just waiting on this. And that is going to be so fast. That's why I'm going to wait until we're ready to finish this up. And Sandy Curtis, thank you for the 50 stars. Yeah, my corn in here too. I should have had my corn when I was... Uh... Use it for only corn. And Susan Litton, you are like really it. early, Susan. Your birthday is November 30th. You're early. You gotta remind us when mm -hmm. to come up. Feels like I need to add a little bit more. Okay. I want a little more time, I think. And Carla Hamilton said conch salad is beyond delicious. Okay. Conch salad? Yeah. Mm. That makes y'all make me want I'm about to. I think next week I'm picking up some conch and uh, develop, a, develop a cool little uh, recipe with it. It says it conch or conch? Conch. Okay. It's, it's spelled conch, but it's pronounced conch. And Valerie Ragland, 
got her seasonings today. That's what I'm talking about. Had to replenish the onion, pepper, and the go-to. Okay. Let's see what this will look like before I put this away. Hey, Jay Green, my sister. What's up, sis? I mean, daughter. Natasha Phillips, I see you. James Kelton, I see you. That's cool. That's cool. Fernando Gaspar Garcia, I see you. But I can't read Spanish yet. Sorry about that, bro. And Connie Griggs made an order. Can't wait to get her seasons in the mail. Okay. You order today, it'll probably go out tomorrow. Tomorrow's Saturday. If we get up in enough time, it depends on how many orders we get. Because the post office closes at noon, I think, on Saturday. So if it doesn't go out tomorrow, it'll go out Monday, but you'll get an email. I see you, Cecil Racine Jones. <laughs> <laughs> Tiffany James. I had nasty McDonald's today. Oh, oh, my gosh. You know what? I ain't gonna lie. For lunch today, Anita and I split a quarter pound. It felt so wrong. We split a quarter pound. <laughs> And we had large fries. Okay, all right. Okay. I can crush the all fries right. all day, but not the regular food. Okay, though. okay. Go and talk about me. I know. And we don't eat like that. But yeah, the day was like one of those. We got to get something. We got to eat something. Because we hadn't eaten all day. Trying to push this to the middle, but there you go. Right there. Let me see. Barbara and Mira say catfish and corn. Broccoli and crab salad is on my menu tonight. Fish okay. And corn. Okay. Corn and cob, I guess. I'm assuming that. Yes, I'm assuming. Broccoli salad. What did you say? She said broccoli and crab salad because there's only a common between catfish and corn and broccoli and crab. So. Broccoli and crab. Broccoli and crab salad. Okay. Hey. Luana look. Evans. I ain't <laughs> Not to try nothing hey, out. That's else? new to that me. Broccoli crab. Palette? I'm good. Or maybe it was supposed to be a comma there. That's what I'm thinking. Let me see if this bacon tastes good. Still tastes like bacon. Mm. Still tastes like bacon. Tina Marie, 1015, her B day, okay. How you doing, Cleo? And Barbara Mirror asks, is Mr. Green losing weight? Y'all don't hype his head up. Don't hype his head up. Y'all gonna make me think I'm strong in a second, boy. I'm gonna, boy, before you know it, you gonna be like, why you keep making these videos with all his, his shirt off every day, Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> why, why are you making all these videos with his shirt off? Oh, mess me up, boy. And Pamela Colbert. Have you gone up in a shirt size? Some of your little sizes are busy. <laughs> wow. Wow. No, no, no. This is what I get. I know, I know. And I Tiffany know how James. Her daughter's birthday is October 16th, the big 18. Okay. She'll be 18 then. Yeah. Oh, okay. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the adult. Almost, nah, almost. You, know you close. You, you know can pay why. taxes, so you, know you close. Why. Welcome to legal adulthood. <laughs> I'm still trying to get all the way to adulthood. It's a whole journey. It's a whole journey. You don't just get to adulthood because you hit a number. It's mental, too. It's definitely, it's more mental than anything. And Valerie Ragland lost her mom last year. Her birthday would have been October 24th. It's still her birthday, regardless. Wow. Still there. As long as she's living in your heart, it's yeah. still her birthday. Definitely is. And you allowed to celebrate her. Mm -hmm. How are you like that? You allowed to go ahead and celebrate her. And Trinise Weber said they don't have cream shrimp in New Orleans. Cream <laughs> shrimp. Oh, she means the cream you, with shrimp. Uh huh, yeah. Campbell's makes it. I find it sometimes. It, it's hard to find. And usually when I find it, I'll be like, you know what I'm going to make? I'm going to make me a shrimp chowder. And today I thought about it. It didn't have any area in the house, so mm. gotta do what's screaming. I think it's a TV. I was like, sound like a baby. It's having right. a bad, bad day. And Becky Blue Jacket, her husband passed in 2016. Birthday's October 25th. He would have been 79 years old today. Oh wow, Becky, sorry to hear that, but glad you had a chance to well, have October 25th in your life, because that's what it's all about. We are only here for a moment in time. We are spirit and energy, and we just once this body is gone, we continue on. Oh, so thank you. Sorry, I'm you're not here with him. Falling and behind. Physical. Sorry, people, I missed some of y'all messages, and I'm falling behind because this thing is not playing with getting rid of y'all messages quick. Let me see, Luana. Thank you for the share. We appreciate that. 
I just want to get the potato soft. That's the only thing we're really doing. And Fernando Gaspar Garcia, I truly wish I could read Spanish right now, but this. I can't. I took like nine nine months of Spanish yeah, in high school. Couple words I recognize. I mean, say, yeah. uh, plantos, the plates are elaborate, and something. Uh oh, I love bro. See? <laughs> exactly. <Spanish laughs> something about Spanish cooking. <laughs> something about fancy plating. Look, look. And I think he's asking us to do something in Spanish. Possibly. And Sheila Rails Bradley. If you're having trouble with the order, get with us after the show and we will help you out with that. We will. And Luana Watts is right. Post office is closed this day. Oh, wait, wait. Monday. Monday, Monday, Monday. Monday. So we don't get it out tomorrow. Monday, fun day. We won't be able to, to Enjoy y'all long Tuesday. weekends, people. Yes. Congratulations to people who actually work. And have to. Oh, I'm putting all the water on the ground. How you doing, Linda White? And Sandra Weaver, that's not a good question to ask. That's like asking which one of your kids are the best. Oh, you know, I know. all yeah, your I kids are the best. Yeah, what's the best seat? Like, you can't do that. They all my favorites. They all my favorites. You guys see the ones we use the most, and that's like almost everything. The only thing we haven't used a lot, and it's because it's newer, um, the nacho cheese, but we've used that. We've used that. Um, I don't have a favorite. They're, they my they my babies. They all they all perfect to me. And Lisa Menenda asks, "Have you ever done a fish chowder?" I've never done a fish chowder. I've never done a fish chowder. I've done shrimp chowder. I've done a scallop um, chowder. I've done a crab chowder. Um, but I've never done a fish chowder. Nope. Mm-hmm. New, new, Valerie new, Raglan new. says that maple bacon is great on a baked potato. Let's go down everything. I had all my cr- scrambled eggs yesterday. Mm-hmm. It's great. Literally, I normally don't. My mom made me breakfast, and she said, you might need some salt in there. I said, Mom, I don't need no salt. I'm cool. And then she brought brought the little shaker to me, and I shook it on there. Mm-hmm. I was like, okay. <laughs> and Barbara Amira, thanks for the cleanup, or the correction. She said it's supposed to be a comma, crab salad and steamed broccoli. Oh. She had the uh, corn and the other stuff going crab on. Crab salad. Yeah. Yes. Okay. You said she was having crabs. She was having. Yeah, salad. Well, I read how it was posted. Hey, right, I, I wanted to assume what somebody you. meant. And oh, they, they, they trying to say, "Go, Lisa Menendez, said like you're losing weight." Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> all right. So I can let it out now. Let me see. <laughs> 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 Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> and that's bad when you don't have no muscles in your stomach. You can just blow it up like that. Okay, and Dona Lanier said my granddaughter was born on Thursday. On Thursday was yesterday, my exactly. There you go. Twinning. All right, so we're getting a nice little boil on here. Put that little starch mm-hmm. in the taters. We're gonna help it thicken up a little bit. We got a little help if we need it at the end with a little corn starch. I'm gonna add a little cream there near the end because we don't want the cream to curdle. Um, and this is going to be done before y'all know. I'm going to taste it, make sure the season's good. We're going to kick that shrimp back in there with the seasoning in there. So I ain't going to super season it until we do that. And then we're going to hit that bacon back in there too. My God. My God. And Maria Coward. Hey, Green's family, guess who's coming to dinner? Come Are you through. coming, Maria? Are well, you we coming? Made en- we made enough. You know where the door is. Y'all right? can't take all this stuff to, to uh, work tomorrow. And if I did, they will eat it because they greedy. <laughs> I'm going to take all this to the tour tomorrow. Check How you doing, Edna Hutchison? Now, Tata just was, 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 oh, here, Tata. It's hot over this thing, man. Shoot. I made the taters uh, nice and, yeah, they're getting a little, they're getting there. A little longer, a little more, a little bit more. Oh, wow, Latosha Domina. Sorry to hear that. Um, my husband was murdered 10 years ago, October 8th. Wow. So that day is bittersweet for me. Oh my God. Happy birthday to you, Mr. Green. Well, thank you so much. Sorry about the loss. Mm-hmm. I know um, a loss is, is, uh, is hard. Especially with somebody close to you. It's really, really hard. But, you know, we have to live on and, and live in, in their memory and positivity of the memory. Not just the loss. And Sheila Taylor, I celebrated my 59th birthday October 2nd. Okay. Okay, welcome. 
Y'all are getting up there, man. Look, me and Lee are going to be there one day. Mm -hmm. We at 36 now. I looked at you like you knew. I know, right? We at 36 now. Okay, Debbie High Duke asks, have you ever made Clams Casino and you Clams Oregano? I haven't made Clams Casino. I had Clams Casino last night. Was it Clams Casino? Mm -hmm. Rockefeller. Black Clams Rockefeller, yes, sir. But Clams Casino, no, maybe I'll make. I'm look, see, the problem is a lot of the stuff that I make is just our dinner. And some of the stuff that I would try, nobody else in the house would try. So I, 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 a lot of times I don't end up making stuff that I just that I would like because I would be the only one eating it. So they're not as experimental as I am as far as food goes. Like I'm like, let's try it. And truly bless Ellis. Okay. We are sorry to go. hear that. My sister just passed at the age of 46. She would have been 47 on Halloween. Oh, wow. Sorry about that. Definitely, definitely sorry about hearing loss. We just lost my grandson um, last week. Was it last week? Yeah, last week. So I understand my dad passed a few years ago. So it's hard, but we, get, we have to get to a point where we're not memorializing their death. Mm -hmm. So in other words, all the energy... That you that you put into thinking about them is not only about them not being here, but the time they were here and the good times that you guys had. It's kind of hard to do. It's a lot to ask for, but I mean that's the only way you get over it. And Darla Harris, yeah, for some reason I can't translate on a live at the moment. Oh, you mean it's like use a translate on it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't do that. I want to say this is. Um, and let's remind the people what's on the lobster. I got a few questions asked about what you okay. put on the lobster. Simple, 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 simple. simple. It's so simple, a boy could do it. I got a stick of sweet cream butter. So we got sweet cream butter, we melted it down. We added to that about three quarters of a tablespoon or so of our Creole blend. Our Creole blend happens to have chili, mustard, black pepper, pink Himalayan sea salt, garlic, thyme, onion, oregano, paprika, cayenne, celery, smoked paprika, cornstarch, sugar and a little kelp. So we added that in there. We added some dry parsley flakes. We added a bunch of garlic, like two nice sized cloves. I mean, they were big babies like that. I minced those up, put those in there. Excuse me. And then I added another little pinch of paprika just to give it a little more color. And that's it. That's all we did. That's all we did. So we're gonna, that's all the flavor that we need here. So. <coughs> These bad boys, let me just And this. Erica Wilson, you said we're back in the classroom next week. You mean the kids are back in the classroom where you at? Unless she in there. Yeah. And Joshua Jensel said he loved the shirt you got for your birthday. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and Luana Evans, thank you. You said all the seasonings are great. I was supposed to add that with the, uh, with the, uh, the vegetables. That's what I usually do, but it's okay. White wine is gonna be good. Let me give it a taste before I add the uh, before I add the sweet cream any more and any more uh, seasons I need. Oh wow, Kim Arcade, my daughter's birthday was October fifth, and my granddaughter's birthday is October seventeenth. Okay, pretty good. I'm going to thicken it up a teeny bit. I'm going to add that sweet cream. It's going to add a little more sweet in there. I'm going to season it again. And Val White suggests, is that a white? Try Jane, okay. Try a fruit omelet. A fruit omelet? Mm. Mm. So, mm, that's different. So, in the egg, instead of having chopped vegetables, I would have chopped fruit. I kind of like how you're thinking, Miss, whoever your name was. <laughs> I don't sound too bad at all. Liz Coleman, how you doing? And Fernando Gaspar Garcia, I can't translate what you're saying, and I honestly wish I could read it. I kind of feel bad because I started learning Spanish, and I just let it fall by the wayside. But I remember all the curses, though, surprisingly. <laughs> of course you would, Daryl. Let me see what's going on in here. And I got a 
Debbie mm-hmm. Braveman Haikia asks, do you like French foods or Greek foods? Yes, I do. I like all foods. I have a love affair with food. Like food you say food. all foods. Have you tried like some of the, what we would consider out, some of the Eastern let's, foods? Let's say this, Daryl. <laughs> all types of, all genres of food, not yeah. all foods. Because like, you know me, I don't like uh, uh, chitlins and things like mm-hmm. that. A lot of stuff I do not like. I just don't like it. Uh, most foods, I I love every type of food or trying any type of food, and I have a problem with that at all. Mm-hmm. Mary some stuff that are not my favorite. Let's put it like that. How about that? I got you, Mary Diener. All our recipes can be found at the link pasted correction pinned at the bottom of the screen. Cookingwithgreensfamily.com. Find all the recipes for free. You can find our knives. You can find our other merch. And you can find all of our seasoning blends. All our spice blends, man. All of them. Merle Hodges, all how are you doing today? And Dorothy Johnson, yes, he did put cream in there. Okay. All right. What'd she say? Moringa? I got Erica Wilson saying she's been looking for moringa in her supermarket. Has anybody seen it in their local stores, either leaf or powder form? Nope. You got to go to Italian uh, um, international markets for that. That's what I was thinking. International too. food market. Okay. And Debbie Hyduk, we are not in New Jersey anymore. Although you was born in North 62 years ago. We're currently in Virginia. Yes, Mother Dearest. Nothing. Good okay. How you doing, Vicky Belly from Kentucky? Let's turn this off. Let's get our. Turn it off. Don't turn it off. And Rose yeah, Wilson asks, "Can you do a seafood boil?" Yeah, we can do another one. <laughs> Rose, you must not have been watching. Nah, she probably. See, I said that. We can do another one. I don't have a problem with doing another. Lydia one. Lydia Hardy, how you doing, young lady? I think is this the boil? No, down the bottom, baby. Remember. Remember when we tried to we figured this out? We was like, we got a broiler down the bottom. We didn't never know how to use it. No, I still don't. It's down here. You gotta put it down. Quandrea Marcel, how you doing? Belinda Florence, how you doing? Got a Helen Mack. Rosie Laverde. Martha Houston. Net White. Bernice Clark. Tina Marie, see you again. Erica Wilson, thank you for that, for reminding the people. Thank you. Okay, let me get this in a little mic for Ooh. a second. And Susan Linton, I just lost my oldest son. It's been four months, and I'm still having a hard oh, time. Man, Sue, sorry to hear that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember when she told us about that. I hate to hear that. Definitely hate to hear that. How you doing, Mary Parker? Right here. God, I love that pink Himalayan. But... Where it go? Oh, I don't see. Oh, there it go. That right there. It's like the Don Dada of the seasoning blends. According to Daryl. <laughs> According to Daryl, this is the king. Oh, thank you, Doris. Robert Tally Nelson, how you doing? What's up, Rob? I know he out there fishing. Probably. This dude, on, he the fish king right there. Linda Hayton, how you doing? Jacqueline Houston. Up, oh, Liz Jones. My mom's birthday is today. She's 84 years young. Okay, Tell mama okay. I say happy birthday to her. That's what's up. All these great people that are born in October. Y'all see that? Nita and Daryl. <laughs> and Quandrea Marcella, thank you for that. She said Fernando is saying make Spanish dishes. That's what he said. That's what I thought he I, said. I, yeah, some of that I recognize, but not all of it. We're going to make some Spanish dishes. So let's make some Spanish rice or something like that. Or arroz con pollo or something like that. Something simple that anybody can do. Well, we got we got, we got to take suggestion week or something one day, mm-hmm. one week. I like to make stuff that I never made, too. I ain't scared. It's because I ain't scared, y'all. I ain't never scared. And Carolyn Neal, the lobster spread should be on the website by now. Lobster spread. The way you just did, I'm, I'm assuming she meant oh, what you no, just did. Oh, no, I will, I will. That's so super simple, I felt like it wouldn't need to be a recipe. But, I will. <laughs> if y'all want it, I'll give it to you. I don't have a problem with that. 
Uh, Royal okay. Lobster. It's super simple. I definitely will do that and the little and the little mixture that I made. It's a super simple recipe. I'll put it up there. And Maria Cowers asking, I want to know about the cruise because I'm diamond on Royal. The cruise we're gonna mm -hmm. have to relook at because I want to make sure that um, we can still do it next year. We have to we have to I have to renegotiate pricing and stuff. Because I know a lot of people are pulling out um, of cruising right now, so I want to relook at that. So I will try, you know what, That's, I will try to, by November, I'll try to have an update on the cruise, okay? That gives you guys over a year. How you doing, Robert Epps? What's up, cuz? That's my cousin. That's my cousin, Robert Epps. Up, oh, Leighton Morris, Jamaica in the house, I see you. And Kenosha, Sean James. My husband's birthday is the 12th, my son's the 23rd, and my mother's is on the 27th. That's a lot of gifts right there. That's like December for us. Like December 2nd is my daughter Nicole, the 15th is Anita's, 27th is Jennifer. Then we got January oh, 3rd. Oh, Laney's is right there too. Oh, yeah, 24th. my granddaughter's is December 24th. 24th. Ooh, what? Wow. I wouldn't forget it. And then. My son's is the 3rd of January, right? Man Man's is January 1st. And then my other grandson is January 1st. So that's like a... Mm -hmm. And then my dad, when he was still here, his birthday was like November 22nd. So as soon as November, the end of November, we would get hit with... Oh, my God. Birthday's like crazy, bro. Like crazy. Go, 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 and go, go. Quadria, Marcella, I so appreciate you. She's translating for us for Thank um, you. Fernando. Thank I appreciate you. you. That's, uh, 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 what's her name, um, daughter? Um, uh, Murray. Remember Murray Brister? <laughs> Remember him? It's not familiar, actually. Yeah, he's a good old church. Big guy. And June Parsa, we are in Virginia. And she asked, Two us, minutes. have you ever tried Sudanese fish? It's very good. Never. Y'all y'all got to send me some recipes or something or taking me out or something. <laughs> that sounds good. Sudan from Sudan. Sudanese mm -hmm. fish. I wonder what they season it with. How do they prepare it? You're going to make me do like some. I'm yeah, Kima some Thomas, first time viewer from Jersey. Jersey in the hills. Mm -hmm. yeah. We appreciate you. Thank you for being part of the family. Uh, Miss Sierra Dennis Mays asked, what kind of cream did you use? Oh, uh, okay. heavy whipping cream. I usually okay. always use heavy whipping cream. Um, the difference between the heavy and the regular whipping cream, it's like less than 2% more um, milk fat. So it's a creamier and it's a little sweeter than me. So I like to use heavy cream a lot of times. Oh, and, I thought that was this. No, What's that's the microwave. Oh, the microwave. Yep. Oh, I forgot And Koshi Orderly asked, huh? have you had African food yet? I'm from Guyana. I've had African food before. Oh, I didn't mean that. This, this. You fricasseed it. I've had it. No, no, it's still good. I just wanted to melt it up real good. I'm putting this brush in here because it has some good butter in here. I'm going to melt it out. And Debbie says, the only food I don't care for is Indian. Maybe it's the curry. Just yeah, can't eat it. Yeah, you know what? It. I went to an Indian wedding once. And an uh, engagement party, I guess it was, too. And a lot of their stuff is, like, real pasty. Kind of like an African, um, um... And some African uh, uh, meals, but they were good. Like everything was like, like a like a paste. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, which is, it was good. It was different because if you're a textural person, you have to get used to that. The flavor is good. They're not afraid of spices at all. I'm gonna tell you that right there. So they were good. They had some sweet. They had some savory. How you doing, Virgil and Mary? How you doing, Antonio oh, Carey Barnabo Campo? I'm gonna give another. I work minute. with Old Campo. One more minute. <laughs> oh yeah. And Danny Culberson asks, "Was your brother on high or low?" My brother's on high, five twenty-five, all, all the way up, all the way up. So you want to cook it on a really high heat, and you want to do it quick. So now that's the best way to do it. Right and everybody's saying, "Mama looks beautiful." Oh, you mean my own yeah. mom? Yes, okay. my mother there was. Oh, my yeah. mom came out? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ashley McCaff from Texas. We see you. Sharon Masterpiece Brown. How are you doing? Oh, oh, Got a oh, Danielle oh, Collins oh, from South Jersey. Tania Stocky, how you doing? 
Yes, boo, yes. Okay. And Sherry Barton Wilson says the black onion pepper is the bomb. Okay. Yeah, that's Anita's favorite too. Mm -hmm. She likes that one too. Okay, I got you, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm taking you out. There we go. That's cool. That's good. I don't really want to. Marion Tucker to from that. Brooklyn. We see you. Robin Stover, North Carolina. All right, let's get these bad boys out of here. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Yo, this is not where you store your pots and pans. Okay? Psh, whatever. This is not where you still <laughs> store your pots and pans. This is your brother. And well, the dishwasher most... where you let like, dishes dry yet. <laughs> yeah, my, th my dishes are still there from last night, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, oh. Do y'all see this even? Do y'all even see this? And I got a, what's that? Ooh. Kiss, hmm. Ooh. Kiss Me Edge Ooh. Wade is asking. I'm pretty new to the page. Are majority of the seasons salt free besides the pink Himalayan salt? Uh, anyone, yes, majority are salt free. Anything, I'm gonna get this in another minute. Anything that says no salt are the no salt blends. But we'll have four no salt blends out of the 17, and the rest of them are. Uh, what's 17 minus four? 13. Brit the other 13 <laughs> are, are, are salt blends. And the pink Himalayan sea salt blends, and. They are less sodium than most other blends because we try not to make the salt the, the star of the blends. You can get all the ingredients and everything on our website and on the side of the bar, bottles. Let me give it another, like two minutes almost. And Juana Cadres from New Orleans. How you doing, little lady? Linda Ortega, Cameroon, Texas. And the Cameroon, Evans. Texas? Is that, that where she's from? Well, Cameron, Cameron, Texas, my I'm bad. Say, wow, that's, I think it's a country called Cameron. <laughs> it is, actually. And Luana Evans suggests cook some gumbo. Okay. Okay, we'll make gumbo again. See? Y'all mm -hmm. y'all, act like y'all ain't watching. Y'all acting like y'all are not watching over here. Carla S. Anderson Hamilton, thank you for the 50 stars. And she said, she, Carla also said she applied to the Patreon. I want to know if it went through. All right, I will. I will check it out. Um, after this, I usually get like a little kind of notification mm -hmm. when new patrons come on. So I will let you know. And Wanda Swerdin, you are mad early, December twenty seventh. We get in October right now. You gotta wait. Oh, good catch. <laughs> Our snacks fell out, y'all. Y'all, we don't know about these. Ooh, this is the jam right here. Boom, chicka pop. I never had it. Man. That's a popcorn? The sweet, yeah. the sweet oh, and salty ones? Your mama might get smacked after that. Submit. Right now. Your she mama smacked back, though. I sure do. Your mama just might get smacked. Samantha Blake, new to the channel. Glad you found her, Samantha. Thank you, Samantha. Huh? Yeah, it's, it's, it's about done. So we should have like 30 seconds or so. Let me take it out if you like. No, that's like the 30 seconds. Okay. This, uh, this one will be yours. You want one piece of shrimp? I don't even want any shrimp. You don't want any shrimp. I knew it. That's why That's why I was making it like that. That's okay. enough. Okay. All right. And Melissa Smith, thank you for the Melissa share. We do here. appreciate the shares. And Darlita Harris said her family had 12 birthdays in August. That's Goodness a lot, gracious. right? Y'all, I know you want shrimp, so I'm putting shrimp in yours. Mm -hmm. I don't know what Nita talking about. Blake what? Mary, how you doing? Cassandra Green, I see you as well. Janice Michelle like says. You got like pieces of shrimp in yours, bro. Shrimp is good for the body. Yeah, I think so. Who says? I know bacon I is. So, You don't know all the answers. I ain't trying to. Like, Leia got a lot going on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, she's a nice long message with a whole lot of birthdays, though. Okay. That's done. Carol West, how you doing? Stephanie Shepard, love Indian minute, food. Get out another yeah, minute. Yeah, get out another minute. That one on the end is, is, is a little bigger. I think it's what's going on. Yeah, another minute, babe. And Peggy Dubu, thank you for that. I'll check into it. Karen Walker suggests chili beans should be on the menu. Okay. Chili beans? Mm-hmm. Chili beans. That's what she got. Okay. Oh, I thought she was saying I should put that in this. No, it's on the menu in general, I was saying. That's that's different. Cause I never would have had 
chili beans and a um, shrimp chow over there. Hey, who wants to stop you? You know what I'm saying? I got a Von Hicks from Arkansas, okay. And a Sharon Jenkins from Is he from Arkansas or is he from Arkansas? I call it Arkansas. Everybody's called that's, Arkansas. That's, I'm going to call it Arkansas. Where, oh, that is, that <laughs> Mama in Arkansas, I'm going to call him Arkansas. That, that's really what it is. <laughs> <laughs> People, people in Arkansas, you know, say both ways, I guess. And Andre Miller says, salute my bro. Um, Champ Mills, the brand. Check what it out in Champ? Atlanta. What up, champ? Y'all, if y'all into, uh, uh, if you guys are into, um, cigars, he's got his own cigar brand line. Great quality, uh, product. Minority owned, of course. And he's doing his thing. Champ Mills. If you haven't heard it, you better put it, write it down if you are, if you are a cigar aficionado. You need to have that in your life. Now look at this. Look at the cooking green knife. I just gotta put it in here like a little, like it's like it's good. <laughs> like it's part of the deal. Like it's part of the and deal. And Carmel Griffin is asked, how do you know when your lobster tails are done? They're gonna be not opaque, not translucent, not translucent mm -hmm. and a, more of a whitey, uh, fleshy feel. So that we had the one, they were, they're a little larger than normal time, so we're gonna stick them in there for a few moments. That's all. Shamika Edmondson, how you doing? How you doing? Camilla Barnes, you are not late. You showed up. You still here, so you ain't late. And Danielle Collins, go ahead and order your seasonings. Go ahead. And Valerie Raglan, come on up. Just come on to the door and knock. And Deborah Flowers asks, have you had turkey steaks? Yes, I haven't in a long while. Well, yes, I've had turkey steaks before. Well, yes. turkey chops is what it is. Turkey chops is what, what we call them, but it's probably the exact same thing. Oh, yeah. Turkey chops, yeah, we've had those before. And JP Dunbar, thank you for the 20 stars. Ooh, this about to be good. And JP Dunbar says, a wet slash damp towel is a recipe for disaster. Been there, done that. A wet, damp towel. towel. The recipe for a disaster. Been there, it's done really, that. It's really not good because it, you get a lot of uh, bacteria going. Mm -hmm. You put it inside it. Yeah. Deborah Levis. I, I see. Yeah, I wanted to broil for a quick second. Oh, we'll put it back on broil. I'm, I'm gonna see what look what she looking like now. Oh no, now she good. And Mickey held as I'm going to make a seafood boil. Any recipes for a good butter sauce you have? Yes, ma'am. On our website, <laughs> I got a nice great crab dipping sauce. Brother. Oh, I'm sorry. You're a woman. Sister. <laughs> Sister. Sister. Patricia McBride from Jamaica. I see you. And Betty Lumpkins, Betty that Sons. new lady in the kitchen is my beautiful mother. The new lady. <laughs> yes. The new lady. <laughs> yes. No, you got your, you got your wig wow. on the day. Mm -hmm. oh. who, who is this new lady in the kitchen? I'm wearing Jessica today. Jessica. That's her name? Jessica. She got Jessica on the day, y'all. And everybody's saying you look so pretty, Ma. Oh, thank you. And Blake Mary, you can go to the link pinned at the bottom of the screen. It, oh, I see people already said something. All right, thank you. Love y'all. Love the supporters and the fans. Thank you for that. Keisha Grace, how you doing? Barbara Tucker, how you doing from VA? You right in the arena, okay. Brenda Westmoreland, welcome, welcome, your first time viewer. Glad you're here. Definitely. How you doing, Sonia Henderman? I know somebody gonna want something. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a good question. Samantha Blake asks, uh -huh. is there anything you can do if you dry out the lobster? Mm. Dry it out? 
mouth. Chop it up and use it in something else, like a soup. It's, I mean, you can always eat it. Oh, you mean if you overcook it? Yeah, that's how I'm assuming. Not really, no. <laughs> no. It's going to end up being rubbery and not really good. No, I wouldn't. Chop it up and use it for a soup. Throw it in the freezer, and if you do like a seafood um, mm -hmm. soup or chowder or something like that, that's that's all I would do. Okay, so. We, yes, I Vanessa Holmes. I see right outside, Vanessa. Come on in. Is we as ready? Is we as ready, y'all? And Joanne L. Thomas, first time viewer. And you can look at the link at the bottom of the screen, Joanne. www.cookingwithgrainsfamily.com. You will find the seasonings, the knives, the shirts, the aprons, the recipes. Yes. It's all there. Everything that we have. So let's uh let's let's try this, guys. You want um, a little of the sweet white wine, babe, or no? I got a little okay. bit of safety first. You people are, are low-key freaking out about the knife. Here you go, people. I would take it and move it out the way for one of y'all have a connection. Okay. See, there you go. Wait, this this got shrimp in it. This ain't mine. Uh-uh, that one is yours. That one got no shrimp in it. Yes, it is. Oh, it does? Somebody right mixed them around then. Who you mixed it around? around. You did. And that little one is supposed to be yours. That's what I want, the little one. Yes, my dad definitely excels at plating skills. Boom, let's take this little, it don't matter. And Charlie Ingram very, Connors, very first time viewer, thank you, baby. thank you. Why this thing is, it's not doing all my emojis, okay. I don't know, I'm different sauce. You want a little different sauce too, Daryl? Oh, yes sir, yes sir. Well, Let me see well, if I got a little. Good. You want some, babe? No, no, I'm good. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna put a little bit in this. <clears throat> and then I got a Susan Lynn asking, do you guys ever make stuffed cabbage? I'm yes. Polish, so I make yes. them a lot. You have a, a stuffed yes, cabbage yes. recipe on the website. Y'all ain't been watching. I think she's new. She's okay, fairly we new. Yeah. Yes, we she's do. Free you, get, you get free. You get a freebie, <laughs> Susan. Or whatever. What her name was Susan? Yes, Susan Lynn. So Lenton is not oh, new. Yeah, I just thought about that. I heard her name was loud. Not new. We gonna have to. We have to recycle some of our old recipes now. I see. Mm -hmm. so people can remember. They're all on our <laughs> website. So just go to our website, check them out. So let's get some. Let's get some eating in, y'all. And Luana Watts Evans said, "Anita, my late husband used to give my wigs names." <laughs> Neither. Neither just started giving names. I ain't never seen her give names yeah. before. And you did it. So Dar, you I want um some of the sweet white or you want something different? No, I got water. I'm good. You water? Okay. Yeah, me too. I'm gonna do water. Me too. I'm gonna do water into wine. And Shirley <laughs> Boyd said it looks good from California. Too, okay. Wine, you know? I'm gonna stay my grace and ready to get started. All right, babe, go ahead. Tell us what you think. Tell us what you want, what you really, really want. I'll tell us what you want, what you really want. Mm -hmm. It's hot. Mm. Oh, I love this. Good. Mm hmm. Oh, I got this up. It was easy, too. Yeah, you might need a little knife. And Carla S. Little Anderson little Hamilton. Thank you for the 50 out. stars. You can pull oh, pull it, it out? Hang out if you want and just. Yeah, you can just pull it, pull it, pull the meat off. If you like, just do a little twist. Okay. There's a little piece there you might not want to waste up. Um, you can get a, if you want a little knife, or you can just. No, it's so tender. Mm, ah, Cindy Butler good. Harris, thank you for the 50 stars. And I got a Mary Durden Patterson asking, What's the name of your lipstick? You look so beautiful. I got a Bob. Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Since you can't get wig. Since you got some bare minerals. <laughs> that sauce is good. Yeah, like that? Mm, you guys taste it. It's really okay, good. Okay, well, I'm going to let Daryl taste it before I taste mm -hmm. it. You know, I'm always the last to taste mm -hmm. it. Yeah. And Sydney Butler Harris, mm. thank you for the 100 stars. Really good. Carlos Anderson Hamilton, thank you for another 50 stars. Yes, ma'am, guys, Carlos carrots in it. Good. I try to keep with some sweet vegetables. I have sweet red pepper, I have sweet carrots, I have a little celery. Yes, um, I use the cream of celery um, you know, um, instead of the cream of shrimp because I couldn't find okay. cream of shrimp. Boom. Let's see what Daryl going to do here. Mm. Where can I buy what you cook? <laughs> Look at the grocery store, Zelma. At the grocery store, Boo Boo. We showing you exactly how to do it. How we doing here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. said, Kendall, Kai, Kylie, McGriff. We got to make this. Look, the recipe is on our website. So simple. Gina Zarelli, 
What's up, sis? Good to see you. How you get the gray? They said, how you get the gray out of your hair, dye your hair, and cut it off? No, Helen, that's not it. That's what, That was a wig. You a wig. Good to see you. Somebody said, say grace first. Don't don't be messing. Just give it like a twist. There you go. There you go. You already butterflied the whole thing out. So, If you like extra efficient, you keep those shells and, and freeze them so you can make a seafood broth. But I'm not that guy. What's your arm? I'm not that guy. What are you talking about? That's soft though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah? Good? Right. This is good, man, babe. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. The baby's like it, Jesus. Look at that. A sprinkle of Creole on my hand. A sprinkle of Creole? Sure, sure, sure. You can always look. That's the good thing about these seasons. They ain't gonna add a lot of salt. Gonna add a lot of flavor. Yeah, a little sprinkle, sprinkle. There you go. Get a little sprinkle, sprinkle. Watch out. I might do a little sprinkle on mine since you do. I'm a copycat. Dad, you want a little sprinkle on yours? No, I had no heat this morning. You got no heat this morning? Okay. What'd you eat this morning? Uh huh, yes. 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 Mmm. Mmm. It's my favorite wife in the whole world. That's right. All right, let's see. Um. I'm going to go ahead and, and just taste this some of this so right here. Let me say my grace real quick. What do you say, babe? This is so comforting. Oh, I'm you glad I, I'm glad my food can comfort you. It does, baby. You are so good. Oh, you're my favorite wife, girl. Mm -hmm. Okay. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this food we're about to eat. We ask you to bless it for the nourishment of our body. And I'm going to hurry up and eat mine before Daryl finishes all of his. Amen. 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 Mm-hmm. Oh, 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 got a big old piece of shrimp right there. Uh-huh, let's see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, smoky is good in there. Sweet is good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, that right, right there. Um, I want to, but I got one hand. Um, you want to do what, babe? I want to take this off, but... The way the camera <laughs> hold it for a second, just right. Just for a second. Just watch you break it up. Just for a second, bro. Just for a second. Just for a second. We're not asking for a lot. Mm-hmm. Sit over there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm good. I'm good. Y'all. Ooh. My Jesus. Yeah. Okay, lobster. You need a little. You need a little knife, but you come on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold it down. Hold it again. Hold it again. I'm gonna go ahead and cut through my stuff, and you're gonna be. You're gonna be. You're gonna be, you're gonna be good. You're gonna be good. You're gonna be good. Right, right. It's a nice little bite piece. It's a nice little bite piece, right? Mm-hmm. It's a nice little other bite piece. Kind of like chunks, not pieces. Here go a nice little other bite piece slash chunk right down the middle. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Now I can see. Now I can talk to y'all and eat. Oh, Jesus, y'all. Do y'all see this? Mm -mm -mm, sweet. Mm, tender. Mm, the sweet tender. Oh, the sweet tender. That sauce, you ain't lying, man. Mmm. The garlic in there, the Creole blender was in there. Mm, mm, mm. Oh yes, oh yes. That right there is the whole business right there. Do y'all see it? Oh my God, do y'all see that? Oh my God, it's so bad for you and good to you. Oh my God. Mmm. Mm. Banging. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. So good. Oh my God. Thank you for the 590 stars, Samantha Blake. Some, look, Maria's on her way. <laughs> Somebody said, Nita, let's keep loving new look. Thank you. Ah, uh, yes. Patricia McGride, how are you? 
So I'm going to put this, since you were asking, guys, I'm going to put this simple, simple way to, to prepare the broiled lobster. It's super simple. I'm sure you remember it. But people were asking for the recipe. The recipe for the easy um, shrimp and crab. Well, I have, I have it down there as a shrimp and crab chowder, but I just kept, omitted the crab. You can add crab in there if you want later on. That recipe is already on our website. All of our seasoning blends, bam, you can get on our website. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, they are. And they're all good for you. Look how I'm touching each one, y'all. Look, see that? See how I'm touching every single one and the ones down here, too? See how big my hand is? But <laughs> you can get those. You can get our knives that we use on our show, our T-shirts. We have um, some Cook McGreens merchandise, uh, aprons, T-shirts, things like that. So um, you guys can get those. The soup is, well, on the recipe, again, somebody asked what's the name of this. We have it on our website as shrimp and crab chowder. Okay, man. Somebody says save the save those shells, save money. Look, we love you guys, man. We thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, lobster, and they're on sale right now. So if you have a Harris Teeter, go and get yourself. It's there, they're on sale now. We love you guys, man. We're about to eat. Um, thank you all for being here. Mm mm mm. Dawn said, why you look like daddy from the side view, <laughs> Daryl? You see? He said, you look like me from the side view. Okay. Thank you, Dawn, for 100 stars. We love y'all. I'm about to kill all this because y'all hold me up from eating my chowder right now. I'm trying to get <laughs> in it, and I'm not trying to eat it all in front of you. So we love you. We'll see y'all again, I don't know, maybe uh, tomorrow. maybe tomorrow. tomorrow? So okay. We'll, do it Sunday. we'll see you tomorrow. Sunday, remember, Sunday we're going to be in the Vibe District of Virginia Beach. If you're in the Virginia Beach, Virginia area, Anita and I will be there from 10 to 5, I think it is, 10 a.m. to 5 a.m. Okay. Um, at Vertical Vibe is the name. You can Google the address because I can't remember the address. It's right on the ocean front. Um, there is an art crawl going on. So this is at one of the art galleries. We're going to have our spice blends, some of our knives, some of our other merch. We'll, we'll be there um, giving out uh, distance hugs. And um, I'll have some, some of my art there. Whatever art I don't sell there, um, I will probably do an auction next week online so you guys have a chance. Because I'm, I'm, I'm doing these art pieces and I'm not hanging them up or anything. I'm not, I don't want to keep them. Um, so I'm just doing it for therapy. Um, this is my last piece. I, think I, I don't know if you guys saw. I did the one here with the, with the sky. Um, and the airplane taking off and the moon and the stars and then I added a, a companion piece if you will that can be displayed like this if you like on top of each other and that one goes up to the you know the milky galaxies it's got shooting stars in there it's got a little hidden uh, little swirl galaxy way in the back there and I'll be getting rid of these two also and probably that one there, back there with the eye. That one's not finished. I might do the, yeah, I think I'll, I'll bring that one also. Negative space one. This guy's the sun's rise. Um, that guy's not done yet. So I'll bring a couple of pieces. So hopefully we will see you guys there. And no, I'm not an artist. I just happened to, I just happened to start painting about three weeks ago. So, um, Love you guys much, and we will see you again. No, I'm not an artist, Lisa. <laughs> I just happened to buy some art supplies about three, three weeks ago, and just started painting. So we love you guys, man. Anita's getting some more. Yeah, and we're here. And we love you. We'll see you again tomorrow. Thank you for being here. Thank you for guys for twenty-two dollars and seventy cent with the stars. That's gonna help feed another family. So we love you guys, man. Thank you. <laughs> Peace.